Hey, it's Jill from You Evolve Buffalo, and today we're bringing you another free workout. Today, what we are going to be doing is focusing on four exercises, and the way that this is set up is almost like an hourglass. We're gonna start doing um, 10 repetitions of each exercise, and then you're gonna go ahead and work your way down, and if you really wanna challenge yourself, you can work your way back up. So to get started, first, Sarah and I, are going to show you the exercises that you're gonna be performing. So if you go here, we're gonna be doing a side step squat. You're gonna alternate sides and it's going to um, be per side that you're going to count. So we're gonna start off with 10 of these on each side. So we're gonna go ahead, start off going to our right. When you do this, think of just as your traditional squat that your hips are going back first and your butt down, but we are taking that step to add a little bit um, more difficulty. And we're gonna also, it's gonna also help us uh, focus on our hips as well. So we're gonna go ahead, you ready? Mm -hmm. All right, starting with the right, we're gonna come here, one, together, together, two, three, trying to get low, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, and one more on each side, ten, and ten. Good, good, uh, little fire off of the legs there. So that's exercise number one. Exercise number two, we're going to do calf raises. You really want to focus on your balance and stability with these <sighs> literally here and you're just going right up on your toes if you can try to not go all the way flat foot so come here and then just to where your heels are just very very slightly elevated we're gonna be doing this for ten in three two and one two squeeze the calves three four five six seven eight nine and ten good exercise number three this is going to hit upper body but it's also going to be a bit of core as well you're going to go down we're going to be in a plank position here and we're going to be doing shoulder taps so you're going to bring your right hand up to your left shoulder um, alternating so you'll be here right hand left shoulder replace left hand to right shoulder replace when you do this you want to make sure that you're not rocking back and forth and that you're staying super stabilized and strong we're gonna go for ten on each side just like we did with those side squats in three two and one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten nice job all right that was exercise number three you can go ahead and stay right down on the ground exercise four we're going to be doing full sit-ups with an overhead reach so when you do these you are going to be down laying on the ground on your back your arms are going to be extended over your head here and then you're going to go ahead sit all the way up if for any reason you can't complete a full sit up you can go ahead and just do a crunch instead so we're going to go ahead and show you we got our 10 here let's go ahead and start back down and coming up one two make sure you're focusing on your core three four five six don't bounce off the bottom. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Nice job. So that was your first set. In order to complete this workout, you're going to go ahead and work your way down. All of those same four exercises you're going to do for nine reps eight reps, seven, six, until you get down to one. Like I said, you really wanna challenge yourself. You can work your way back up from one to 10 and you've completed the full hourglass. If you have any questions at all, uh, feel free to shoot us a message. Let us know what you think if you get this done. Challenge one of your friends and uh, get out and enjoy the day. Have a good one, everyone. Thanks, Sarah.